The Rick Lee Wrestling Invitational is back in Bemidji this weekend. The 16-team dual format tournament is in its 30th year and for the first time took place at the Sanford Center. We'll start things off in Pool A, a heavyweight matchup between Bemidji's Xavier Whalen and Otter Tail Central Cyan Bueller. Just over a minute into the second period, Whalen gets the reversal, then the pin officially at three minutes, seven seconds. Another heavyweight matchup in Pool A, Black Duck CLB's Chase Johnson gets the takedown on Kenyon Wanamingo's Jesse Jackson and then pins him three minutes and five seconds in. Here's a look at your Pool A standings. Kenyon Wanamingo going 3-0, Bemidji going 2-1. Black Duck CLB 1 and 2. Moving to Pool B action, 145 pounds, Grand Rapids. Dylan Kislyoff flips Farmington. Seth Marshall, he gets the near fall as time expires in the period. Then later in the match, Kislia gets the reversal for two points. He'd win by decision, 8-2. Grand Rapids would win the duel. They would end up going 2-1. Purim going 3-0 in that one. Moving to Pool C, 126 pounds. Early first period, Deer River's Jamal Baird throws TRF's Jake Davis to the mat for the two-point takedown. Later in the match, much of the same. Baird shoots the legs and gets another takedown. He'd win by decision 7-1, but TRF would take the duel. As you see there, Frazee going 3-0 in that one. TRF 2-1 and, and Deer River 0-3 in that duel or in that pool. Moving on to Pool D action, Brainerd taking on Detroit Lakes at 182 pounds. Brainerd's Morgan Gibson gets the reversal on Noah Olds. He'd win by decision 6-3. The Warriors would win the duel 36-30. They would end up going 1-2 in that, in that pool. Big Lake going 2-1 and one in Litchfield 3-0. and oh. If you've enjoyed this segment of Lakeland News, please consider making a tax-deductible contribution to Lakeland Public Television.